And of course, as I said in my last video, uh, that a lot of it, that it seems like a lot of these, a lot of this vaccine uh, information, or should a lot of this vaccine distribution is basically being slow walked, and it's intentional. And I just wanted to point this out real quick. NYC um, vaccine hubs are ghost towns, as DOH mum on our mum on distribution. It says the city's 15 vaccination hubs were ghost towns last Saturday, and the city Department of Health is refusing to reveal just how bad distribution went. One DOH staffer stationed in Hillcrest High School hub in Queens on January 30th said he did nothing all day. You cannot imagine how much how much nothing it was he said of the demoralizing day he said that there were about 70 workers on hand some earning overtime pay for 12 hour shifts and about 10 people to vaccinate the worker said several hundred excuse me several, several appeals were made to the doh officials to be able to vaccinate people without appointments and they were denied he said the hubs had about 400 to 700 doses. We could have used that day to vaccinate thousands of people, and we blew it. And that's basically the point that I talked about in my last video, that what you're watching is the intentional decay of a city. This isn't, this isn't just because of incompetence. I don't want people to think, yes, typically governments are shitty, and they, they do a very poor job. This is by no means done because of incompetence it's done intentionally to artificially uh, slow slow the vaccination process because they don't want things going back to normal neither do they want people thinking that things are going to back go back to normal and what you're going to see across america but not just in america but in other places as i've said in my last video that multiple countries in france italy uk eu are all experiencing a slowdown in their distributions of, of the vaccine. And it is done intentionally to destroy jobs. And of course, what will, what will eventually happen is, of course, it will make individuals dependent upon the government. The governments will sit out there and hand out some form of UBI, basically making many of these individuals into slaves. And basically, because there will basically be no jobs because of the artificial uh, destroying of many of, of, their, many of their economies. And this will, this will be the end result, that many of these individuals will go hungry. There will be rampant crime that's it's happening here. It's only the beginning of what's happening here in New York City, and it will by no means be the end. We're literally seeing the beginning of the agenda starting to unfold right before us.